This is the Epson DS32000 series scanner. It's a ultra-fast, flexible, large format desktop scanner. And today I'll be showing you some of the basic overview and setup of the scanner. This scanner comes with a USB 3.0 cable, AC adapter, and a power cable. To connect your cables, first open up the cable cover, then connect the USB 3.0 cable to the right side, then connect your AC adapter to the left side, and you can close up your cable cover. If this is your first time connecting the scanner, don't connect your USB cable yet. To adjust the orientation of your scanner from a storage mode like you see here to a scanner mode, uh, first step we're going to do is lift this back latch, rotate it down until it clicks into place, and then to turn this around we're going to open up the paper uh, input module and the output tray as well. Once your scanner is powered on, you will see three options on the screen. Scan, scanner maintenance, and settings. The scan is where you can initiate the scan or change the settings for that. Scanner maintenance is where you can view all of the counts for various maintenance options on the scanner. And settings is where you can view or change some scanner settings, such as uh, view your scanner serial number. Once you're ready to scan your documents, you have a couple options here. You can adjust the guide to scan all the way down to receipts or business cards or licenses, all the way up to wide documents, as well as adjust the paper handle the carrier and the output tray as well. To put the scanner into flatbed mode, first step is to push the lever in the back. While it's pushed in, we're going to push the scanner to a flat orientation. There is a switch here to switch the orientation of the display. And now we'll be able to see the three pre-functioned buttons in order to perform our flatbed scan. And this concludes the demo of the Epson DS32000 series scan.